So the next thing to do is to create all the colors we need for the project. And to do that, I'll go to the window menu, the home of all panels, down to color, and then choose swatches. When this loads up on screen, then I will go to the panel flight menu and click on new color swatch. And from here, I will turn off the checkbox for name with color value. I'm going to call this TAB for take a break and then pink. And then I'm going to make sure that the cyan is set to a zero. Um, magenta, that just needs to be set to 97. Yellow, I can leave that set to 24, which was, uh, was quite lucky. And then black set to zero in there. Now, I don't need to click OK because I can actually click on Add. I need to create several colors in here. So when I click on Add, it will add it to the list in here down at the bottom and I can just carry on and make another color. So if I call this one TAB Yellow and then make sure that the uh, cyan and is set to zero. Magenta then, I'm going to set that one to 10. Yellow, I'm going to drag that all the way across the far right hand side and set black to zero in there. And then I can click on Add. And then you see my colors always are added at the bottom of the swatches panel in here. And then red. So I need to change the name up here to red. And then for this one, this needs to have a cyan of eight, a magenta of 100. So I can just drag that all the way across. Um, I will leave yellow set to 100. And then I'm going to have the black set to zero. And I've got the name set up there. So I can click on add. And then finally, uh, I need blue. So change the name at the top and then make sure that the cyan is set to 100. Um, the magenta is set to 35 and then the bottom two are set to zero. So we got this uh, kind of deeper blue color in here. These are all kind of swatches that I have tried to replicate from the actual magazine. And then on this occasion, well, I can click OK because I don't need to create any more colors. They now all appear at the bottom of the swatches panel there for me to use for the consistency across all the different objects and text and things like that. And um, with that done, that's all the swatches made.